Hey everyone, I'm Heath Daniels. I'm here today at the studio of artist Barry Morse. Barry is a multimedia artist who has a show happening this week at the Antebellum Gallery in Hollywood. The name of the show, Barry, is called Narcissusy. Um, I'm gonna let you explain that title for me. Well, Narcissusy is um, based on being a narcissist and also being a sissy. So we put those two things together and you have narcissistic. And you're a little bit of both. Yeah, and I think the show, <laughs> the show reflects that. You, t you told me that if you see something that you like, you want to be it. Right. Be it that a, a bodybuilder, a competitive bodybuilder, or a drag queen, which you've sort of been both. Right. Um, tell me how that relates to your work. Are you always trying to, to push that sort of um, transformation thing into, into the work that you do? Well, I guess it, it has something to do with childhood, growing up with a lot of blonde and blue-eyed type of people. Thinking, thinking that I, that's what I was. And yeah, me when too. You, when you finally realize that you're not, you, you start either trying to fit in or you, you start celebrating your differences. And so that was sort of the beginning of it. But um, it was all about what are the boundaries that I could push as far as passing as an old person or passing as a young guy or passing as a woman. And mm -hmm. it was like trying to be real or trying to get a reaction from people and just see how dressing up or changing yourself would um, affect the way other people see you. Well, it's interesting, speaking of uh, costumes, the first time that we met was at the Ultra Fabulous Beyond Drag right. show, where you addressed as French Fry, one of your alter egos. That's so right. this is the first time I've actually seen you oh. outside of costume. So this is <laughs> wow. what he really looks like. Actually, the mouse from Mouse's birthday. Okay. And this is the cockroach head from Mouse's birthday, but that's not what he wears in that film. This is a panel um, that's part of a project where I have a portrait taken of myself every week um, since 1994. So what I'm doing is I'm trying to capture the aging process and also capture my many different hairstyles and. Just, I keep the backgrounds to wherever I am at the time, so it's sort of like a diary. Probably the last photo in these thousands of thousands of photos that I'm going to have in my life is probably my death photo. Mm -hmm. I would think that would be a nice ending to this project. You just did a, a, a portrait series where you had your photo taken as a variety of sort right. of celebrities and, and um, famous people. This is a skirt from Frida Kahlo. Your Frida Kahlo portrait is actually really quite spot on. We have like Saddam Hussein, which is like this sort of military And who doesn't want to outfit. dress up as Saddam Hussein? <laughs> we got to show these, so... Well, I look more like Saddam Hussein, Hussein than I do Brad Pitt. You know what's weird is that Saddam's outfit is actually... I would wear this out. <laughs> this is a good costume, actually. We picked people that I could do. Okay. This, I was, this was a collaboration with a photographer named Martin Levine, and he is from Czech, and he did not want specifically American things that they okay. wouldn't recognize. Now, they would recognize Marilyn Monroe, but I don't look anything like Marilyn okay. Monroe. So we chose people more like Cher and Sarah Jessica Parker and Frida Kahlo. This and is more Sarah Jessica? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, just like head shape and whatnot. Okay. Actually, you could make a good Sarah Jessica. I think that I could make a good Sarah we'll Jessica. We'll have to try that. Yeah, later. I like that. <laughs> You're defined as a multimedia artist. Which, really, in the true sense of the word, you are multimedia. Yeah. You're, doing, you're doing painting and photography and film. You're also doing costume design. Was it always all of those things at the same time, or did it sort of come over time where you went, I'm, I'm going to do photography now, and then sort of the costumes started happening, and then the painting? And For me, art has always been an explosion of everything. Mm -hmm. And if only when I was younger I would have known about Warhol and um, John Waters, because I was doing that kind of stuff when I was in elementary school, but it was not of that quality. Yeah. And so the potential was so much there to create incredible works of art when I was younger, um, but it took a lot, it took a long time to, to really uh, maybe have some reference points about where I fit into all of that. <laughs> Barry, for showing me around your studio today. Thank your you. show, Narcissisi, will be at the Antebellum Gallery. Yes, in Hollywood on June 4th and 5th. You guys make sure you check it out. Mm -hmm.